Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the museum, all the viewers, all the subscribers. <laughs> I got you fishing with me. Oh, you go everywhere you. I go, like Dirk said, you. like Dirk said. I see you. I see you. Yeah, man. I feel living. I feel good. I'm better living as always. You know what I'm saying? I just dropped the mixtape. I'm feeling good. My son's getting big. I'm good. I'm, he I'm healthy. God blessing me, right. man. So That's I'm real. straight. I'm That's good. Real. I'm living. That's How are you? Man, I'm doing good. I'm doing all right. Listen, this is my. I'm interviewing you. Right? <laughs> <laughs> now, I'm doing good, man. I, I can't call it, man. That's what's up. I just, I just love doing this, you know right, what I'm saying? Right. Glad that you're here, you know, the streets are talking. You know, everywhere I go, they're like, yo, bro, please tell me you heard that feed the streets. <laughs> <laughs> like, oh, geez, I it. So, you know, it, it was only right, man. Right. It's only right, the streets is buzzing. Right. But talk, talk to us real quick, man. You got feed the streets out right now. Um, can anybody do your first project, second project, um, third project, that's fifth actually, project? That's the, that's the first project first I ever put project together, man. ever put together. I, I actually... Fire. I've been doing this for a couple of years, like three, four years. Right. Um, I've just been making like little random songs, right. and I'll make probably a video for one of them. Or, right. But that was the actual first project my man, Smeeg. Okay. What up, Smeeg? Okay. Kept telling me, like, you know, do this music, my nigga. You feed the streets. Feed the he streets. put the battery in your back. He put the battery in my back, like the Energizer Bunny. I, as soon as he said, feed the streets, mm -hmm. I went home, I smoked, I thought about it. I'm like, my nigga, this, this nigga's so right. I need a. I need to get my name out there. I got to finish. I got to show them what, it, what I can do. So that's, 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 that's all I've been doing. Right now, now, um, you, you can't, I, I, at the end of every interview, I say you can't deny the joke. You know, yeah. Hustle consistency, you can't deny the joke. Oh, now, sure. you know, this is one of those things where you can't deny the product. You get what I'm saying? Everybody's talking about it. You know, and that, that's what you want. You want everybody buzzing. Yeah. You know about your music. And for you to put out your first piece like this, yeah. um, I really, I really respect what? what you got going on. Um, as I said before, you know, what really uh, attaches me to a lot of the, you know what I'm saying, the street music and all this industry is their, their confidence in what they're saying. Yeah. You get what I'm saying? I feel like every song on this, on, on this piece here, you definitely had a lot of confidence. What? You were sure about what you were saying. What? what was your mindset going into making this project? I know you said, you know, you made it's like, yo, you got to beat the streets, but really, like, what was, what was KJ's mindset like? All right, producing this project, putting this body work together. What, was, what, what did you want to happen from you? Um, the mindset was really... I gotta feed my, gotta feed my friend, you know what I'm saying? I gotta, I gotta start somewhere, and this is the perfect place to start. You know what I'm saying? I dropped a, a, a video called Moment. Stizzy left lane, you know what I'm saying? He, 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 he's working hard out here. Hardest work in Boston, my nigga. Hardest work in Boston. He was, he, he was like, yo, okay, you need to drop it. So he dropped it. You know what I'm saying? I, I thought, thank you, I appreciate that. After that, I just was like, yo, I need to go full throttle. You know what I'm saying? So, um, what I wanted to get out of this was more just a, uh, I want y'all to know who I was, but I put that out for the streets. I was talking fast money, I was talking drugs, I was talking everything like that, but I wanted the streets to kind of get a, an idea of who I am, what type of sound I bring. You know what I'm saying? So that's kind of where I was going with that. You know, I didn't know people was gonna actually fuck with it like that. Yeah. They fuck with it, but they fuck with it, so I fuck. <laughs> you, you know what, what I'm saying? saying? <laughs> exactly. You gotta put it out there. You I put it out there. there. I'm getting a good. I'm getting a good response. So I, I, I appreciate all the love. Right. You know what I'm saying? I appreciate everybody that goes out there and clicks on the link in my bio on Instagram or whatever they do. To show support, I appreciate it because we live in Boston, my nigga. And you know what it is in Boston. It's tough out here. Yeah, Honestly, so. And I credit you because that's why, like, you know, being that it is that tough out here. If people don't know you from always rapping to something, it's kind of hard to get people to support your music and talk about your music. Because right now, I, think, I feel like the biggest thing in our city is word of mouth. You know, if this person tells you about it, you're going to check it out because you, you, you got credit in that person with that person. Say you value what that person says. So oh, for sure. if somebody, you know, like I said, a few people come to me like, yo, you got to check out KJ's mixtape. Yeah, yeah. Like, oh, yeah. <laughs> What's up, man? And then I, I, heard it, I was just like, Wow, man, man. You know, you, you, you definitely sound seasoned in this, man. You sound short, man. Like I said, 
I had a couple years on my belt. Right. I didn't really know what to do with it. I'm still learning. How, right. You know what I'm saying? How to maneuver. Okay. So, you know what I'm saying? I, I, I did what I could, and I'm going to get better. I guarantee y'all that. But, so, so, you said YB. So, a lot of people don't know. I did have um, Holla in here. You know, we, we chopped it up with Holla. Um, you know, uh, Kenny was in here to explain yeah, the, uh, the YB, the young boss. How, how, for that. how am I getting here so late? Yeah, how you know, am I getting here? <laughs> uh, when did you put this out? Uh, no March work, 1st, March no 1st, work, no work. interview. You right. You heard him, right? Y'all heard him. Man, Young Boss, Young Boss, Better Living. Mm -hmm. That's what I rap. Like, okay. Young Boss, Better Living. Basically, boss stands for brothers overcoming struggle to succeed. You ain't got to be stunning. You ain't got to have a chain. I don't rock no jewelry, none of that. You ain't got to have none of that shit to be a boss, my nigga. It's all guy. mentality. Yeah. It's all mentality. Yeah. That's the problem with Boston artists. And a lot of artists everywhere else. It's like, you, you, you know what I'm saying? You get the boss side, you think you gotta be a boss. You gotta have a rose voice, you gotta have yeah, all this, you gotta have the chain, you gotta. Nah, yeah. you gotta be in control of your life, yeah. your lifestyle. You gotta know how to move in these streets. You got, that's being a boss. That's, when you got a team full of niggas, mm -hmm. you a boss. Right. You don't even gotta be and the captain. The you don't even gotta be the captain, you know what I'm saying? You just, you boss and you with your niggas, I ain't got a job. I'm a boss. I gotta make money for my son to eat every night. That's so that's how I live, better living. That's the next level. That's where we headed. <laughs> that's where we headed, my nigga. Flag over there. We had to decorate. We had to decorate. We had to. Those, 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 those are only half of what we got. You know what I'm saying? There's a lot of shit that I haven't even got. I know. So, I, I know. I got something that you ain't got. You got a lot of shit down there. <laughs> we're going to talk about that. We're going to talk about Let's talk about Feed the Streets real quick. Right, right. What's your favorite record on Feed the Streets right now? Oh, For the lazy man. people favorite out there, record. so if, 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 if you're like, all right, cool, all right, what's the one song that you would give people to be like, listen, if you listen to this record, you'll love the whole thing? I would probably have to say my favorite song. It's probably, um, I would probably have to say Double Up. Double Up. You know what I'm okay. saying? I love Double Up. I just love how. How it, it, it's just it, that type of song just vibes, you know what I'm saying? You ain't gotta be up, you ain't gotta be down. It's just like you can turn that on at any moment, no matter how you feeling, and you know? that shit it knocks, you know what I'm saying? So I like I like a couple songs on there. Yeah. Me myself and money, me hush tip. Hush tips. Hey, but good vibe to it, man. Keep it on the hush tip. Hush tip. Hush tip. Keep it on it. I dropped that. I dropped that today at twelve. It's March 4th. I dropped that today at 12. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? I got a good review. I got a good response yeah. back from that. The streets was feeling that. They was feeling that before I even dropped the shit. Yeah. I was I doing a show. I was listening to Hustip before you dropped the video. Word, And I was word. like, yo, this record is... That, that honestly... Because I'm, I'm, I'm big on, like, producing. I'm big on, like, the beats and things like that. And, like, okay. how the beat makes you feel. Yeah. And, like, I got a nice, fresh feel from Hustip. Word. It's just like... When I heard that, I was like... You just start. You know what I'm saying? You gotta get your jiggy with it. You know what I'm saying? You just start bouncing. Nah, and, and it's funny because when I went in the studio to go do that. I had 20 minutes left in the studio, bro. Like, if, you know Fresh. Fresh was like, you got, you got 20 minutes left. I just went in there. I was like, who want to hop on this? They, I played the beat. Nobody was feeling it. I got up on there. Keep it on a hush tip. Yeah. Everybody in the studio was like, yo. That's what's up. So, and, and that was a that was a throw in. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to throw that in there. That turned out to be my best and track. And turned out to be one of the, one of the bangers. That's what's that, up. That, that's 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 you got Feed the Streets out. Yeah. Tell everybody where they can find it. Tell everybody where they can, you know what I'm saying? You can find. Any other music, you know what I'm saying? You can find. I, I got music. You can call my phone. I'll give you some music. But <laughs> you can find Feed the Streets. That's going to be on Audio Max, SoundCloud. Um, I was about to be on that Pit pretty soon. You got the USB drives. I got the USBs. Drives. I got like five, six hundred of them yep, USB drives. I'm about to get those out. I'm sorry. I, I didn't even bring them. You got videos I got, I got you Moment. Got moment I got Moment with Stizzy Left Lane on YouTube right now. 10K plus and going. Mm -hmm. I got Hush Tip. I just dropped this morning. Yep. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. April, I'm going to open up for... April 20th, we 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 we, we, we doing we doing iTunes. shows. Hush tip going on iTunes. Oh man, you working? You working. We work. Yeah, we just trying to stay I busy. We just trying to stay busy. Um, you can find me on on Instagram, Kenneth underscore YB. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Well, what else I got? What else I got? What else I got? I got Twitter. Uh -huh. Young Boss KJ with a U though. Young mm -hmm. Boss. 
Um, we got what we got? We got with SoundCloud, KJ Dot, YB. We got a couple joints, man. So I'm, I'm, I'm trying to make my rounds in these, you know what I'm saying? This music business, man. I'm just trying to stay relevant. Look, stay consistent. Don't worry about staying relevant. Stay consistent. Definitely. Definitely. You got it. Trust me. You got it. Appreciate that, My God, man. So, look, I already know, man. 2016 is real promising for you, man. Especially with this putting this out the top of the year. I got three. I got two more tapes on the way, man. I got a couple videos already done. I got shit brewing, man. I'm not, I'm not playing no, we, with you niggas, we, we, man. We gonna need you back. We gonna need you back. I'm gonna, gonna be back. I'm gonna be back, gonna gonna be back, back next that. next tape summertime. I got shit for the winter, like. Okay. I appreciate what you do for niggas, man. Look, you you put you put Boston on. Man. Look, feed the streets is out here right now. Definitely. Make sure y'all go get that. And if y'all need the USB, he got that. All right, hit him up. Listen. So before I go, you already know. If you hustle with this team, if you find quality work, they cannot deny what's dope. Tell him. This is a prime example. First tape is buzzing. Tell him. KJ Watson. Yeah. In this world, I don't trust shit. Yeah, them niggas shooting better duck quick. Yeah, I pray you miss me with that fuck shit. And if they told you I was getting money, then tell them keep it on a hush tip, hush tip, hush tip. Keep it on a hush tip. Yeah, tell them keep it on a hush tip. Yeah, tell them keep it on a hush tip. Yeah, hey yo, this is for my YB boys. No, my D boys.